Good day, YouTube. How are we doing? Uh, <laughs> welcome back to all the mods. How are we all doing today? As you can see, I'm a bit ghostly right now. I died. Uh, I died. Oh, I could float as well. Uh, I, I was doing mining and I came up and then a lightning bolt struck and a guy spawned. He's just despawned now. Uh, he killed me in like a hit. Whoop. Got my items back at least. Man, he hurt. He hurt. I hear a spider somewhere as well. Oh, super tail. Cool. So yeah, first death. Didn't get it on camera, but you know, it still exists. It still exists. Uh, so yes, in between episodes, I did some mining. If you can't tell by the amount of ores I have. Not a lot of iron as of yet. I've smelted some there. I think that's all. I think that's all the iron I have. I, I have made tools. I made an iron axe, uh, an iron pickaxe. I did find this on a skeleton I killed. Murderous stone axe of the Colossus. And I believe this is all to do with apothecary. Apothecary? Apotheosis. Uh, it does a 12.7 attack damage. That is nice. It's also got an empty socket. And I'm wondering if these gems, like this here, these guys, I'm wondering if they do something. So that says fire damage. I presume that makes the axe have fire damage then? Where was the other ones? Base plate armor, base overall. Arrow velocity. So armor piercing, would that be good on an axe? I don't know. Overheal? Base overheal? I thought it said overall. It says overheal. So I don't know if any of these gems are realistically... Was fired. Let's see. I don't know how this works. Do you just do this? No. I'd imagine you need an anvil if that's the case. Which we don't have. Anvils are expensive. There's a lot of iron. We've not got a lot of iron. However, I did want to get on camera. Um, I died before I, I was need to get back down to the mine. I have now got down to bedrock. As you'll see us going through the world. Going down the different layers of base stone. Um, different coals. I've stopped on this level here with a little platform because 15, I believe, is where iron will spawn. So I'll do some strip mining in this level at some point. Uh, a little cave, water cave area, which I mind if you asked. Now we're into the deep slate area. Where we've got some silver and some platinum uh, and we've got some deep seat uraninite. 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 Uh, and then we hit the lava pockets, which was very annoying. Uh, there's like lava all around here, as you can see by the dripping stone, into this sort of nice sort of bubbled area, which could be like a, a midpoint for going down mining further. As you can see, we're at minus 42. Uh, I had to actually go past my mic there to see that. It's tiny. Uh, more uraninite. Uh, we've got some osmium. So we've got some mechanism in here as well. So if we wanted to get into mechanism, we can. Uh, but more importantly, down here, <gasps> diamonds! Yeah! First diamonds of the pack. Uh, I didn't mind them because I wanted to do it on camera. And, oh, we have actually got enough to do. Nice, we've got four diamonds. Sweet. Always nice to get more than one on your first diamond find. Um, I always kind of mine around it as well because the. They're sometimes connected adjacently also. So, you know, never never hurts just to just to mine about. I think, I think, I think, I think it's done. So, at Bedrock, as you can see there, this is your diamond and sort of redstone level. This is where you'll find the most diamonds and redstone is down here. Which is, um, which is cool. This stuff takes a bit to mine, even with an iron axe, a pickaxe. As you can see, it's. Whew, takes a bit of effort. Takes a bit of effort. Um, but as I said, we'll, I'll probably do more mining for now up higher level than this, up at the sort of 15 height. Um, so I also said we'll do some. Uh, what we're going to set up in, as mods, which, to be honest, I've not thought a lot of. Uh, I don't do a lot of pre-planning in these, if you can't tell. <laughs> uh, 
However, I, I am thinking, do some things of immersive engineering early, get some, get the ball rolling, shall we say. Uh, get some... I'm thinking of using power, power, uh, that urana, uraninite that we found. Let me draw that early. That's not there. No, it's uh, Zycodium. You, you seen what I was on about. Uraninite for making power, because it's got a good few different... Um, I could just go here. I don't know why I'm... It's got a few different options for generating power from a basic coal generator, furminator, to magma power, uh, to thermal generators, solar panels, and into reactors in the later stages of the game. Uh, so there is definitely options to go down that route, and I think I, I think I want to. Uh, as for storage, I definitely want AE two because it's new. It's I want to play with that. Uh, I don't know if I'll get into it too early, however, um, power restrictions and whatnot. So there is something cool from occultism which I'll want to get into. So this might be the first mod, or oh, unless I do something to do with thermal just to get basic okay yes i think for basic uh stuff to start off with i think i'll do a little bit of thermal you know get uh get our pulverizer and redstone furnace from thermal because they're super cool there's also thermal extra interesting i didn't know there was another an extra mod for it i like cool so yes we're, we're, we're Thermal systems. There is power generation in thermal as well, which I've never used. No, 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 no. I think I think I'll stick with doing power stuff. So that needs something like a, a basic furninator, which does need a lot of iron, and also needs lava, I believe, or blaze powder. So lava or blaze powder. We've got and clay. We've got coal. We can get clay easy, we can get a lava bucket, because there's lava down there. So it's iron that I'm going to be struggling on first. So, first cut of the season, I'm going to do a bit more mining so far. Uh, and get some of the required materials, hopefully. Uh, and not use up more iron than I mine. Because I be like that sometimes. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, for Pete's sake, this this was a bad one. This was a bad one. Is there anything interesting there? Actually, just, just to peek in. Not par. What's that actually? Huh, I don't know what those are. Wee. So let's go a different direction. So yes, uh, I'll cut here and get some mining. Hopefully, find a lot of iron during my mining session. I'll see you in a minute. And I'm back. So, uh, I did a bit more mining. I've got a bit more iron. Not as common where I am by the seams of it. Uh, but we have got some. We've got some. Hopefully enough for what we're wanting to do. If not, oh well. Say uh, <laughs> la vie. Say la vie! Uh, now, some... We're, we're going we're gonna to start off by making a furninator. And for that, we're needing these dielectric rods. These guys are pretty straightforward. I need coal, clay, and lava. That's that's the recipe I'm going with, because it seems like the most efficient. Uh, because I've not been to the nether, so I've not got any bones rods. Looks like I've got some clay here. There was also clay, I think, in the village when we went past it, I believe. Uh, so we need some coal. Oh, I've not got a lot of coal left. Did I find some? I did mine some. We've got coal, it's fine. So let's get some dielectric paste. Boom, 24. Hopefully that'll be enough. Otherwise I'll have to go down and get another bucket of lava. And we're needing these guys, which needs these guys, which needs most of my iron. You need a lot of iron. You need a lot of iron. So eight of those. And should I just do eight of those? Yeah, why not? You, you don't, you can actually turn them into each other so you don't off to make two different crafts, but I'm doing it anyway. So let's say and get... Oh, yeah, we don't have enough iron. Uh, this sucks. Yeah, there's a different... Um, big. 
Is there some some cool pickaxe I can get just now? Probably not. Um, pickering. I haven't got a pickering. Well, that's a point. Is, is there a... Um, there is osmium picks. Ooh, should I grab an osmium pick? They've usually got high durability. Yeah, they do. Uh, let's smelt some osmium. I'm sure I grabbed some. I did. Let's um, smelt some of that stuff down instead of wasting any more. Because I broke my pick, hence the stone pick. Oh, you are. Okay, cool. Oh, oh yeah, there it is. I was like, where's the bubbles? Oh, we do have bubbles. I'm confused for a second there. So let's make a couple picks and then. Yeah, I don't think we've got any other iron with me. I've got lots of copper. <laughs> Not that that's very useful. Nighttime. <laughs> Nighttime! Oh. Four. Oh, I totally forgot about quests. Uh, yeah, so this mod pack also has a quest system. Which I totally forgot about. And we've actually been unlocking some of them as we go. Uh, nice. So we get our book. All the modium. So there is tips and tricks. There is sort of early game stuff, you know, that you could get. Uh, I guess it's raw copper, unfortunately. Um, mystical agriculture. We finished that. That'll get us the book. Uh, mechanism, because we mined up osmium. Means I get more osmium. And I've crafted it, so I get even more osmium. Uh, elemental craft, because I picked up something. Yeah, shard of some sort. Nice, also. So yeah, there, there is actually a, a quest line that you can go through, getting started. Yep. Oh, cool, we get some steak from doing that. Uh, I, oh, oh, I mean, I've played Minecraft a lot, but these are still worth some of the rewards you get, especially a lot of levels. So... In my mind, do do this if I were you. Just uh, just do it. You get stuff for doing it, so why not, right? At least in my mind, I totally forgot that existed. Uh, why well, I've got that in my main hand? There we go. Uh, I need some. Wood. Sticks. Turn into... I'll just take two picks for now. Let me take you... Put basically all the way. I don't want to put... I'll take my bucket down with me and we'll get some more lava whilst I'm down there, just in case. So, uh, I know we just... That's another five minutes gone past. Of me doing nothing. I'm gonna go down and try and mine some more iron because I need it. I need it. Not got enough. Not got enough. Everything just takes so much iron. So I'll be back once this time. I'll be back once I've got enough. Okay. I thought that'd be enough, but it wasn't. I'll, I'll get enough this time. Um, I've also been very unlucky with water. <laughs> it's, it's a lot of water. I've gone this way, so let's uh, let's go mine here. So, uh, I'll be back once I've done this. So, how are you guys doing? I'm getting chased by two baby zombies. And now a pillager. <laughs> I'm back! How you all doing? Uh, I've been mining. I uh, hope for that pillager will ignore me being so far away. Probably not, knowing my luck. So, I've been mining. Uh, I, I filled my inventory. I forgot to take one of the boxes down with me, like I said I was going to do. Uh, but that's me. Uh <laughs> Pillager is very close, I might have to try and kill him. So, another thing I thought of doing was clearly having to make another chest. Nice, two shot. Uh, clearly make another chest since everything's full. But uh, for now, I, just, uh, I might need to cut some trees down. I'm not going to use this axe. This axe is my killy axe. Where's my choppy axe? Choppy axe. Oh, I've got some wood on me, actually. Getting wood. Um, yeah. There we go. Uh, 
There we go, more chests to me to just do this with. Wahaha. So, yes, I, I got lost for a second there. What I'm wanting to do is make something with uh, copper. Amass some copper ingots for your exploits in fluid manipulation. I, I don't know what that is. What is this? Oh, create? That's far away. Or hammer from um, all the ores. These guys are kind of broken because you can du duplicate, you can double your ores just like that. So good. Uh, I now have over a stack of iron, which I can't smelt because I've not got enough coal. Did I get more coal? I don't know if I mined more coal. Right, let's get some of the stuff back out again. I don't know if I actually need those things, but I'm taking them anyway. Torches. And... I think... So I need another furnace. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. So there's more stuff that I need to make outside of iron as well. Anyway. Whoop. While that smelts, let's keep going. So I do need the starter furninator, which needs a basic capacitor, which needs a block of redstone. Now I do have some redstone in here. So I need a block of redstone. You know, I'll probably need two sets of these. So let's just grab. And you know what? Grab three. Won't craft them all now, but I will. You get four per craft, so I probably don't need them. So it's like that. Boom. Furninator starter. Sweet. So this could technically generate power for us right now. Right now. There's no point. I want to go up to the basic. This thing uh, generates 20... This generates 80, just for another set of crafts. So I think that's well worth it. Well worth it. Oop. What else we need now? Two more iron ingots. Somehow. One more iron ingot. Boom. Done. Boom. Furninator basic. Nice. Uh, now, we haven't actually got a base yet. Maybe I should, like actually lay out base sort of stuff. Here. Furninator is going there. That is my decision I have made right now. <laughs> uh, I've also just picked up a pile of seeds, which I've not planted any at all so far. So it was kind of pointless me grabbing seeds. Uh, I might stop you for a sec. Because what I'm wanting to do now is actually make a furnace over the pulverizer. Over the pulpit, I want to make a furnace, which means I need to smelt some bricks, which means I need to get more clay, because that's four, eight. Oh, no, I've got enough clay. I've got enough clay. Need eight. Oh, I need to put the coal back in again. Oh. Might need more clay, so I'll just go grab it. I forgot, um, also in this pack, you start off with or excavate, so you can just or excavate everything that you want. Yeah, go, go me for remembering. We've done that. So I need also gold. Now, I did grab gold. I did. Let's uh, ore hammer it. Whoop. Let's also maybe make another furnace. Uh, is there a point making another furnace? I'll just do it. Because I do feel like sometimes I need to smelt things. And I know that's obvious. Let's get some that on the go. What else do I need? I've got copper and an iron nug. So let's make a couple gears. Copper gears. Nice. We're making that. Oh, we need this as well, which is tin. I need tin as well. Tin, tin, tin. I do have tin. That's nickel. Nothing, nothing. Aluminium, tin. 
Now, there's a lot of tin in the world, so I don't know if I really need... I'm not going to bother crushing it. There's our bricks. Turning into big bricks. So I just need these two things, which is my gold. So now I just need this. Oh, glass. Glass, 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 glass. Uh, I don't know if I want to destroy that beach as such. I can destroy this beach. Haha. <laughs> no. Ah, go away. Go away. Don't look at me. I've not got a shield yet. Go away. It's two of them. Maybe not the best of places in the world to park my house next to, but it is where I have done it. Right, let's make ourselves a tin gear. Uh, what else did I need for this? Iron and glass. So I do need to actually smelt more iron. Get that on the go. Some glass on the go. Uh, this guy here, I was going to put in the rest of that tin. Uh, the coal, but I'm kind of, kind of almost used it all up, haven't I? So let's... It can be powered by wood, of course. Because it's just like a furnace. Boop. And yeah, I can get this going now, so I'm actually generating some energy. Which is nice. Nice, 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 nice. Get some of that, get some of that. Which means I should be able to make this. Which should mean I can make a furnace. Cut out. Nice, so we've got a redstone furnace. Boop. Putting that down there should get power from here. You should only use 40, is it? That max use 20. God, that's that's nothing. That's nothing. This is upgradable, however. We can put augmentations and boost up its power level. Obviously, we can't do that. Now, we're a little that's a little bit ahead of ourselves though. A little bit ahead of ourselves. So yeah, we can now just smelt the things straight in here using this. I think this is more efficient. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't think I am. But yeah, we could, uh, if we set up a chest or something here, I did grab some wood. So let's like grab a chest if I can be normal for once in my life. Put this here. Let's say configuration, auto output to that side. Boom. We got iron. Actually, what I'm going to do, change my mind, grab this chest, put it up here. Auto input from the top. So if I were to put my gold dust in there, it will, once it's finished with this iron dust, it will process that through, chuck it out there. Nice. I like it. I like it. So in episode two, guys, we've actually got our F power set up. I like it. I do like it. We've not got the best of luck for actually getting iron. Oh, horse up there. <laughs> um, not the best luck of getting iron in our mine. So what I'm going to do is we're going to wrap up the episode here. And I'm going to do a crap more mining in between episodes. More than I did the last time. Or even during this episode. Uh, and we'll come back and I might do a general layout of the base area as well. Sort of like maybe how I'm going to build it. I don't know. I might do build episodes as well, so I'm just building things and blethering, like I do anyway, but, you know, just to, ow, not doing that. Uh, so it'll just be cool. That'll be cool. I hope. So, I'm the Trish Edkin, signing off today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. Have fun.